A great thing that you can do for your business development strategy is to make sure you are treating yourself and your business in the same way that you treat your customers. Now, I know so many people that are guilty of this and us included from time to time. It's easy to jump in and just start doing something before realizing that, hang on a minute, this isn't what we would tell our customers to do. This is what, what we'd advise them to do. And it's so easy to do that. It's effectively the plumber with leaking tap. <laughs> the amount of website companies that I know that don't have a great website, but they provide great websites for other people. The amount of marketing companies that are so busy doing everyone else's marketing that they forget to do their own. <laughs> the amount of companies we know that provide an outs or help others to provide an outstanding service but then you look at their company and they hardly have any systems in place in their business and it's not because they're not great at what they do it's because they're so busy exchanging time for money that they forget to put those systems in place in their own business and you might be doing this as well so if you are, and you found yourself treating your business very differently to the way that you would treat a customer, you need to take a step back. Because what's happening is, you are stopping the flow of customers coming to you because your business isn't gonna look as good as your customers' businesses do. And whilst people will look at what your customers are doing, You've got to trust that they know you well enough or that they come to you in the first place for you to be able to even make that introduction because you could be losing customers left, right and centre because a lot of people won't even tell you that they've even tried to look for you or they've tried to find this or they've tried to find that. So you need to make sure that your, your own house is strong because when people search for what you provide, it's you they're going to find first and it's your website, it's your marketing materials, it's your brand that they are gonna look at before they even think about looking at anybody else's. So you might not even get the chance to show them what you do for other customers. So do think about what you're doing. Take a step back and review all your marketing materials as if you are your ideal customer. And if you are objective, and don't be precious with it or emotional, if it doesn't sit with you as your ideal customer, then it's not working. And if you get some of your ideal customers to have a look at it and give you very direct, constructive feedback, you might find that it's not working for you for a reason. So do that today and you will get different results. <laughs>